Alright, hello and welcome to Retro Bikes Dublin. Today we're looking at a Honda Wave 110, 2016 with only 7,900 kilometers on it. Nice and clean bar bike. It has uh, maybe the most major little thing, a little scuff on the front mood guard and very minor little things on the left and right hand side. Most likely from fitting down maybe a side passage or something like that. Traded in against us with another bike against one of our Honda Zoomers. It's got a rear back box on it, so it actually has room for two helmets, one under the seat and one here, or else one helmet and luggage or whatever you're carrying into work and so on and so forth. It's a four speed bike. They're capable of about a hundred kilometers an hour if you're lucky. There's four, four gears, like I said, but there's a, an indicator on the dash as well, which is nice for people beginning. It's clutchless as well. So it's the seesaw gearing from Honda's notorious for them. A really brilliant engine, uh, fuel injected bike as well that people like to have instead of a carburetor, less maintenance. Um, tires on front and rear are good. We've had a look at the chain, we've moved the chain, had a look at the fueling system, uh, brakes, everything like that are looking really good. Mirrors are good. Everything on the bike is pretty much original. There's no kind of crap put on her. And uh, she's kind of ready to go. So uh, let's move now from this initial intro video into the visual analysis before we go into the ride along. So thanks for watching. Okay, so here we are at the visual analysis. Like I said, the ma most major thing is kind of scuffing, you know, from getting inside passage, a little scuff here. You have a little scuff on the left hand side. I'm being like, you know, very, very fussy. You know, most people wouldn't even show that in their advertisement. So you have a little bit down here. Alloys are looking good. Tires are good here. The main things, front headlamps, good, no cracks or anything. It's all really clear. You have a little bit of a thing going on here, uh, but it's been nicely touched up. You have a single key with two um, keys for the back box, which is a Jivy box. You have just under 8,000 kilometers on it. Everything here, all the instrument clusters, all really nice and clear. The grips on it are good. Un under the seat then, you have a half face in the underneath that you can fit. You have full face, that you can fit in here or luggage. You have 2016 Reg from Bike World. And your rear tire here. You have a little scuffing on the on the heat shield of the exhaust, but not on the exhaust itself. The foot pegs are good. Rear brakes feels nice. No rusting really on the exhaust. Little bit of scraping going on here, as you can see. Seat is in good condition with no rips or tears. Back box. Let's get on to the left hand side. So left hand side tire is looking good as well. Alloy is good. The chain has just been lubed nicely as you can see. Rear, sp rear spring is good. This is the rear back bo box mount. The rear swing arm is looking good with no real rust. The uh, side stand and a main stand on her. Here's your seesaw gearing system. A little bit of rubbing on the engine which is typical. We have a bit of polishing going on here. That's uh, all that is. And you're up and looking nice. Again, a few minor niggles on a sticker there. And uh, that's kind of it. You know, so mirrors looking really nice. Nice little bike for in your If you're looking to avoid the big uh, fuel prices, then here you are. It's great mileage on this bike, MPGs. Uh, looks pretty cool too. You know, it's nice and skinny getting through traffic. You can get two up on it, fuel injected as well. It's a newer bike. It's a uh, low tax and low insurance. You know, not much you can say wrong about the bike at all. So that's it for the visual inspection. Let's move on to the ride on video. Okay, and before we move on to the video, this little Wave 110, let's tell you about our sponsor today, which is Retro Bikes Dublin and our new website. So our new website has a couple of new features that we want to show you guys and uh, weren't happy with the last one so we made a new one and uh, that one has much better video quality much better pictures of full resolution of the images so you can see them the bike much nicer than you can on the likes of done deal um, or our previous website we also have two new sections which is the service center and the trade-in center so the trade-in center you can put in easily all the details pictures mileage and uh, model of your motorcycle you type it in and then hopefully within the hour, you get a quote back on your bike, either for trade-in or direct sale to us. The next thing is our service center where you can go in and you can put in, the again, the details of your bike. 
and put in what you need done to your bike or what you want done. A general service, don't really know, want a checkup, there's an electrical issue, blah blah blah, blah. put it in, we get back to you straight away with what a quote or uh, what we can do for you and uh, what we recommend. So that's it for our sponsor today, Retro Bike Sublin. Go check it out, www.retrobikesubman.com. Okay, now we're on the Honda Wave 110. I've just got off the Nico 50 Azuri. So this is a bit of the step up, similar twist and go. It does have the seesaw gears, but they're very, very simple to get. Uh, it's just kind of <laughs> turn and go. Uh, I've been told my dad went down to um, the shops to get us a bit of lunch. He said it does about 80 in third gear, so we're looking at probably 100 to 110 km an hour top speed on it, which is fairly quick. And it does feel fairly nippy here, just even in second. And we're going to turn out here. The bike is pretty much new, very low kilometers on it, 8,000. Uh, it's an 16 model Wave 110. It's got a nice back box as well, which we used, which was nice because uh, it fit the helmet in as we went into the shop. So we didn't have to bring the helmet into the shop. And then it, uh, it, uh, it, uh, what you call it, fit all the shopping in on the way back. So it was lovely. You have a little space underneath the seat, which you get probably a half face helmet in if you want to take a pillion for a short ride one day. And uh, you have a full face uh, helmet you can fit in the um, in the in the rear back box, which uh, you could um, use to uh, uh, put your luggage in as you're traveling to work or whatever it may be, you know, a backpack or even just a few laptop or something like that in the back of it and go to work and come back home. Let's do a little turnabout up the top. The gear indicator is actually pretty nice if you're new to a seesaw gear system. And I can tell you now, it's a real peppy bike. For a 110NCC, this is, uh, you know, a lot more than the CC110, which I just uh, got off. So you put this engine in the CC110, I think you'd be very, very happy. Although this bike might just be a bit lighter than that, so that could be why. But uh, we're going to head around. And if you got any to this stage of the video, it would be very helpful if you could like, comment and subscribe on it. Uh, we're nearly at 6,000 uh, subscribers, so that would be greatly appreciated. The next section that we're going to do is we're just going to hop into the electrics. So we're going to do uh, all the indicators, horn, all that kind of stuff in the next section where we put the bike down and we have a look at it as it sits on the road. So let's move on through. Second gear up and over and move into the left here and let's move through right and into neutral easily put it on the main stand and let's go through the indicators front left indicator is good rear left indicator is very good as well rear right the front right, working well, we have our, our diff beam at the front and our high beam, which is going to be hard to see in the sun, but it is working, and we have our horn. So all working nicely, let's get a little picture of her. If you have liked the video up until now, again, like, comment and subscribe. If you do want to reach out to us on our social medias, they are Retro Bikes Dublin for our Facebook and Instagram. And if you want to check out our brand new website, it is www.retrobikesdublin.com. Thanks for watching.